So just kind of like when we went up to the museum and Mark's like, hey, pick out your favorite car. He wanted us to pick out our favorite moment or favorite car being this is the 200th episode. Yeah. And I gotta say, being here as long as I have, they've become uh, our SEMA builds. Oh, those, they're fun. They're the most stressful. To say the least. You know, 2016, we, we did the CUDA, mm -hmm. and that went pretty good. That was before my time, yeah. so. We feel that we got a winner here. Yeah. And then 17, we did the Hellbird, mm -hmm. which is pretty stress-free. And then we did the Little Red Wagon. That was my first one. Yeah, so, and then Christine, yeah, so cool. and then COVID happened, so it kind of shut everything down. Yeah. But for me personally, the Little Dead Wagon was my favorite. What a cool first SEMA build for me. So the 1964 A100 pickup truck. Yeah. You know, with the blown Ray Barton 426 Hemi. Yeah. Was it 1,000 horsepower? Just under. Just great. We put a lot of work into that, and I was yeah. pretty proud of it. And then getting it down to see him having it crap out was kind of a bummer. Oh, that was. But everybody will enjoy it. It's just kind of disappointing that we couldn't get to the actual red carpet event. So I guess we spin up our mask, get the forklift, because we still need to get the thing jacked up and done. Yep. And we'll talk to Mark. All right. It's real frustrating. Real disappointing. We're going to get it lifted four feet up in the air, and then we're going to go out and have a drink. We had a nice dinner that evening. Yeah, we had, uh, you know, it was dim lights. We did, yeah. Had some drinks. Yeah. Um, and then we had music playing. Barf and Gay. It was Barf and Gay. Burgers. <laughs> that was a good time. <laughs> some live music that later was... on. <laughs> <laughs> Little Willie, oh. Willie won't. Well, Hello. Uh, quit drinking and <laughs> thinking of the alcohol. You know, it's been a real treat to be able to be here for 200 episodes. You know, my best friend Mark, people don't always get to do that. You're a spastic colon. A spastic a colon? A spastic colon. How's that? It's a colon that doesn't do its job like it's supposed to. People don't always stay best friends for such a long time. You have bizarre shaped ears. You have no hair. You need to shave that off. You Mark, nice I, can't, I can't let go. I can't let go of this. Here's the three of us after all these years mm -hmm. still together. This is pretty awesome to be a part of this. June 14th, 2012 mm -hmm. was our season premiere on a network called Velocity. It just changed from HD Theater to become Velocity. Yeah. Now it's Motor Trend. The okay, 200th okay. episode is almost gonna air really close to the 10th year anniversary. Oh, so thank you everybody for ten watching years. Graveyard Cars for 10 years, 200, 200 episodes. episodes. Thank you for riding on my coattails and keeping them clean. Oh, happily. Yeah. yeah. I've known Mark almost my whole entire life. Uh, my name is Will Scott. I've been painting with Mark since 1997, since I graduated high school. And for us to be at 200 episodes, when I didn't even thing. think somebody could start a show yeah. doing only Mopars, and to be this successful and doing it, it's awesome. I'm glad that we're a part of it. Yeah, it's amazing to be a part of the team, being able to work on you know, cars that you grew up with your whole life. It's not even and work. It's No, not really. So here's the 200 more episodes, if Mark makes it. I'd just like to thank everybody at home for watching Graveyard Cars for 10 years, 200 episodes. And yeah, he's kind of a co-creator. Thank you. Well, I'm not proud of it, but <laughs> here's to here's to 100 more. We're gonna yes. go for 300 in a feature film. Pete, you in on a feature film? Hell yeah. Tiny Dancer, you in on a feature film? Yeah. Y'all be watching as soon as we're coming, right? Oh, Can yeah. we do that thing with the, where it shocks the seat like they used to do in the 50s, that shock theater? Sure. Can we do that? Why not? All right. Can it be rated R? No. <laughs> Don't understand why. All right, I'll give you a hard PG-13, but, but we'll be very selective. Can 